He is known for being an American writer and broadcaster who is considered the inventor of the modern sports story. Recognized for his juvenile sports novels and nonfiction, he wrote for prestigious publications like The New Yorker magazine. His name is John R. Tunis. In the realm of sports literature, one name stands out, John Roberts Tunis, the inventor of the modern sports story. Tunis, an American writer and broadcaster, was renowned for his juvenile sports novels and his contributions to sports journalism. Graduating from Harvard and serving in the Army during World War I, Tunis embarked on a writing career while playing tennis in the Riviera. As a freelance writer, Tunis penned short stories and articles about sports and education for magazines like Reader's Digest, The Saturday Evening Post, and Esquire. He used his platform to critique the increasing professionalization of sports in America, advocating for the values of perseverance, fair play, and equality that amateur participation teaches. Tunis's work also delved into social issues such as anti-Semitism and racial equality, shedding light on these topics through the lens of sports. Despite not considering himself a children's writer, the majority of Tunis's 24 books were published for juveniles. His books, including Iron Duke, All American, and Keystone Kids, resonated with readers and critics alike. Iron Duke received accolades such as the New York Herald Tribune Spring Book Festival Award for Best Juvenile Novel and the Horn Book Magazine Best Book Recognition. Keystone Kids was honored with the Golden Scroll Award by the Child Study Association of America. Tunis's most notable contribution to sports literature was his eight-book baseball series about the Brooklyn Dodgers, beginning with The Kid from Tompkinsville. This book, often hailed as inspiring childhood reading, has been referenced by sports writers and commentators. Its impact extended beyond the world of literature, influencing renowned authors like Philip Roth, who featured the book and its main character Roy Tucker in American Pastoral. It also served as an inspiration for Bernard Malamud's The Natural and Mark Harris's Bang the Drum Slowly. John Roberts Tunis's writing not only shaped the juvenile fiction book market in the 1940s but also brought attention to important social issues through the world of sports. His legacy as a pioneer in sports literature will forever be remembered, as his works continue to inspire readers and influence the literary landscape. John Tunis, a renowned writer of children's literature, achieved great success by using sports as a vehicle to explore deeper themes. In his books, Tunis went beyond mere athletic competition and focused on imparting important lessons about good citizenship, fair play, and social issues such as racial equality and anti-Semitism. His determination to teach values to his readers is evident throughout his works. A doctoral study conducted at Oklahoma State University in 1996 analyzed Tunis' juvenile sports books and found that the predominant value portrayed in his stories was courtesy and respect. Compassion and kindness emerged as the second most identified value. Interestingly, Tunis did not present these values didactically but rather incorporated them naturally into the narratives. His writing style allowed readers to learn these values through the characters and their experiences. Tunis firmly believed that sports could teach important life lessons such as hard work and perseverance. He emphasized the importance of staying committed to a goal until it is achieved, rather than focusing solely on winning. Tunis heroes often faced adversity and setbacks, such as injuries or social isolation, yet they refused to give up. Their victories lay in their resilience and determination against all odds. Tunis once remarked, My heroes are the losers, expressing his preference for characters who embody perseverance and integrity. Moreover, Tunis did not shy away from addressing social issues of his time in his writing. In his 1936 article, The Dictators Discover Sport, he exposed how Hitler and Mussolini used sports to control and manipulate their youth. Tunis also tackled issues closer to home, advocating for democratic sport that welcomed individuals of all backgrounds and skill levels. He fearlessly confronted racism and anti-Semitism, using his stories to promote understanding and unity. In a world where children's literature often neglected modern problems, Tunis stood out as one of the few authors who addressed contemporary issues without evasion. His work received high praise from fellow writers and reviewers who recognized his contributions to filling the void in children's reading. Tunis, along with authors Doris Gates and Florence Crannell Means, was commended for his ability to engage young readers with stories that thoughtfully explored the complexities of the modern world. Do you want to explore more novelists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.